Well, good evening, everyone. It is 9 p.m. It is time for some uh, for some healing, some clearing, some meditation. And I'm going to ask you tonight, as I do every night, what have you done today to make tomorrow a better place for you? And um, as we contemplate that, let's take some deep breaths in through the nose and out through the mouth. Breathing in fresh oxygen, fresh energy, fresh love, light. Breathing out all stress, all anxiety, all fear, anger, dis-ease. Hello, Craig. Great to see you here. And Kels and Matthew, thank you for joining in tonight. Let's just breathe in and out for a moment, letting go of the day. The past is gone. The future's not here yet. So we stay here and now in the present moment. Such a beautiful moment. So happy to be here with each of you. Austin, how are you, my friend? Just breathing in and out and letting go of this day. Bringing everything into the here and now. And as we do that, let's begin to think about what we want to clear on tonight. As always, it can be anything. It can be health, prosperity, business, relationships, travel, uh, state of the world, weather. It can be quite anything. So just begin to, well, thank you. Thank you, Austin. So just begin to think about what it is you want to clear on. And when you become focused on that, let's take it and bring it into the present moment. Let's begin to think about it as if it were happening right now or if it had happened today. What would it look like, sound like? smell like, taste like, feel like. Good evening, Margaret. Thank you for joining in. So if you brought all of your five senses together and looked at uh, what, it would, uh, what it would be like if it manifested today, if what you were working on manifested right here, right now, whatever you're cleaning on, and then take it and bring it down into the heart, and begin to clear on it in the heart as we start doing our clearing because once you can bring it into the heart you can begin to really sense what's happening as you do your clearing um, whether it's moving or not is it becoming lighter is it becoming heavier what's it doing and remembering that when we're cleaning even though we're focused on that one thing we're cleaning on whatever needs to happen in order for that to work its way through and sometimes when you're cleaning you go well it seems like something else is happening over here and sometimes this thing way over here needs to clear first in order for what you want to clear on to become clear and now i've said the word clear way too many times in one sentence <laughs> oh mary griffin great to see you so yeah let's begin to do our clearing and as we do that we always start with the four phrases of Ho'oponopono which are I'm sorry please forgive me thank you and I love you so just begin to relax and breathe as we begin to use these four phrases I'm sorry I'm sorry for all of the data and memory that I'm bringing into this particular moment in time I'm sorry for being out of balance with what I'm working on, with what I want to clear on. Uh, I'm sorry for whatever it is inside of me that's causing whatever I see out in my world. Uh, next thing, please forgive me. Saying please forgive me to myself for the same reasons I just said I'm sorry to myself. Just asking myself for forgiveness. And then gratitude. Thank you. And as we say thank you, we're saying thank you for taking action. 
thank you for taking 100% responsibility for everything in your life. Thank you for doing the work. And as you thank yourself for that and you thank Source for that, you start to feel it lighten up. You start to feel that joy, that inner joy, because you're acknowledging that you're doing something nice for yourself. And then I love you. And when you look at yourself in the eyes and say, I love you, I hope that you're feeling this big abundance of love, this big opening of the heart. Because when you get that big opening of the heart, that's the true love that you have for yourself. And once you can feel that, then it's so much easier to show love to other people and other things because you understand at the personal level what it feels like. So here we go with the four phrases, I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you, and I love you. I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you, I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. And next we're going to go into our chanting for the evening and we start as always with the Ganesha mantra. Ganesha being the remover of obstacles. So it makes sense that we want to ask Ganesha to clear our way. Okay, Margaret, what are you saying no way to? I obviously, I said something and I can't remember what it was. <laughs> so hopefully I'll remember what you said, what I said that you're saying no way to. <laughs> oh. So here we go with the Ganesha mantra, removing obstacles, continuing on this clearing by removing obstacles in our way. Here we go. Om Gam Ganam 
Vandeya Namaha Om Gam Gana Bandeya 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 Namaha And next we're going to go into the mantra Om Mani Bedme Hum. Om the jewel in the lotus hum. And like the lotus, we grow up through the earth, mud, water, and into the air to blossom into a beautiful flower. That's kind of the path of our life. And then inside of that flower, inside of that lotus, there's a jewel, the Mani jewel, a consciousness jewel. And so we spend, uh, we spend our life clearing this jewel, polishing this jewel, awakening and enlightening this jewel so that it can help us to awaken. It can take us to our own enlightenment, to our own awakening. So this is the premise behind, the, the very simple premise behind this mantra. Uh, and right before we get started chanting it, um, I'm going to put a question out there that you can answer in the uh, comments section. And that is, if I were to set up a single night where we did um, maybe a, um, I think like a messenger, uh, a messenger group where everybody can come in or maybe a Zoom, uh, a Zoom call where everybody can come in and uh, have the opportunity just to ask me questions, uh, especially about anything that we're doing here, uh, or make comments, anything we can do to make these meditations better for you. Would you be interested in that? Would, uh, is that something you would join into and uh, be a part of? So just put it there and we'll, uh, you know, we'll look at it and maybe that's something we can do in the near future. Uh, so that being said, let's begin to do some chanting. We're going to chant the mantra Om Mani Padme Hum now. Om Mani Padme Hum 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 Mani but me home. Oh, Mani but me home. Oh, Mani but me home. Oh, Mani but me Excellent. I'm glad that, uh, that some of you are interested and we'll see how the comments come across 
maybe one Sunday evening before uh, before the nightly meditation. So since we start at 9 p.m. Central, maybe we could do something from uh, 7.30 to 8.30, which gives me enough time to switch everything around and be ready for the meditation. So we'll, uh, we'll definitely approach that. So here we go with the Medicine Buddha Mantra, the Master Healer, the Master Doctor, as we ask the Medicine Buddha to heal our physical bodies, our mental bodies, our spiritual bodies, the earth, the sky, the heavens, all humans, all animals, all insects, all spirits, all beings on all planes of existence. Dea da on beckons ere, beckons ere, maha soha. Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Deata om bekadze bekadze maha bekadze radha samangate soha Just begin to take a big, deep breath in through the nose, out through the mouth. (sighs) 
As we get ready for our nightly meditation portion. Go ahead and adjust your posture if you need to. call forth the fifth chamber of the heart, the generator of love, the super electron. And we ask you now to send forth hundreds of thousands of rhythmic waves of divine love into our garment, up into our mind, and out into our feeling body. And we call forth hundreds of thousands of rhythmic waves of divine love to go forth up into our higher self, our divine self, our I am presence. And we call forth hundreds of thousands of rhythmic waves of divine love to send forth to Saint Germain, Akasha, Asun, the angelic realm, our guardian angels, and all the beings on the higher realms. And we begin to visualize violet, pink, and white rhythmic waves, our flames moving through our body. And they begin to settle into the first three chambers of the heart. The love chamber, the power chamber, and the wisdom chamber. And we begin to feel the flames move up into our pineal gland, pituitary gland, the medulla, the cerebrum, the cerebellum, And as you feel them activating in each of these glands and throughout the entire body, you can begin to send these waves to anyone or anything, anywhere, simply by saying, I send forth hundreds of thousands of rhythmic waves of divine love and a statement as to where you want to send them. So right now, I send forth hundreds of thousands of rhythmic waves of divine love to everyone on these meditations, to everyone who's a part of our community. And I send forth hundreds of thousands of rhythmic waves of divine love into the earth, through our waters, our mountains, our trees, and I send forth hundreds of thousands of rhythmic waves of divine love to all beings living in this earthly realm. And you can take these same phrases and send them into yourself or send them anywhere or to anything you wish to. So take these 20 minutes and begin to do this practice and we'll see you on the other side of this meditation.
Take a deep breath and begin to open your eyes. As always, thank you so much for joining in tonight. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for taking the time and the action to clear and clean with yourself and to join in and build your meditation practice. I'm truly grateful that you're here each night. Uh, I'm grateful for your sponsorship and for your support. And uh, mostly I'm just uh, grateful that you take the time to work on yourself. Take the time to bring harmony into your own life. So until tomorrow night, I will bid you goodbye. Be well, be happy, be healthy, stay blessed. And we'll see you tomorrow night at 9 p.m. I love you. Good night.